You're yeah. on. I know. Hi, everyone. It's Nona Grace. And how are you today? I'm from Western New York. I don't know where you are from. Some of them I do, but I don't know. Oh, that was silly to even say <laughs> that. I don't know where I'm going. But today was a really um, crazy kind of day. My um, daughter Jessica and Emily came by because uh, Jessica. Daughters. Daughters, yeah. yeah. There are two. I had two of them. <laughs> the third didn't show. <laughs> Okay, well, anyways, they came by and they occupied my computer for a very, very long time because Jessica was trying to apply for unemployment. She wasn't going to, and I says, you know, you really should. They made you shut your business down. You really should. So she decided she would. Well, it's so hard to get. She would get maybe logged in, and then it would tell her she timed out. She hadn't even been on there long enough to say so, and it would log, and it would take her out and then she'd refresh and it would bring her in and she might get two or three pages done or to the where it says that you've got because I think there was 10 there's like 10 bubbles across the top and she'd get three of the bubbles done and then it would kick her out or she wouldn't even get that far and it'd kick her out and try she'd try to get in and try to get in and try to get in and finally she got in and she got up to eight bubbles and then it kicked her out and then she got up to where submit and it kicked her out <laughs> so it was taking forever and then finally she did get it and she was able to print it out and um, so she signed up but then I'm going to tell about Emily mm, that's oh, okay Mr. Pete. She's, she may not like it but <sighs> I'm telling you she she applied for the unemployment because her, her boss told her to, to apply for unemployment and so she did and she wants an automatic deposit. Well, today she got a debit card or a card from debit card from a bank that we don't even use. And so she was trying, and they put her. She went tried calling. I guess the number that they have there, which and, is the bank, which would be the bank number. I guess I don't know for the card. And she was put on hold, and she was on hold for over an hour, an hour and fifteen minutes. And you should have heard her. <laughs> it's so sad. So she be hung glad up. Glad you did not hear. Her. I know. Be glad you didn't. <laughs> anyway, she says the government made the mistake, then they can fix it. But they don't know they made a mistake until she lets them know. So the card is here, and she and we looked to see if there was any trial. Um, they're supposed to do like a trial deposit on the account numbers that she gave and I don't know where they got this bank from because we don't even use this bank so somewhere they messed up but she's going to have to get a hold of them to get it fixed otherwise she's going to be out of luck totally out of luck because that's nobody's account as far as I know or somebody else will be getting her money that well shouldn't. she'll have to activate that card to get her money she can do that and she could get it mm -hmm. but Whose accounts are going into if it goes into something? It's probably one, one that, that they maybe maybe her. set they up may for have her. Set up for her. I don't know, but I, anyways, that was the craziest today. And then I went out and I did gather my eggs. I yesterday I gathered my eggs. Every day I gather my <laughs> eggs, <laughs> but um, yesterday. When I went out, and I think in the video I said, oh, only one egg, you're not very generous today. Well, then the other hen that was sitting on the spot that Silver Fox liked, when she got up, there was six eggs under her. So I actually got seven eggs. And then today I got, what did I say, six? Yeah, yeah, six. Because my little white, the one that lays the white egg didn't lay, and the ones that lay the green and blue eggs didn't lay. So I had three that didn't lay their eggs, but... So I, but I got quite a bit of eggs and I fed, um, oh, Kyle was here, my little guy that doesn't like to do his homework that tried with the tablet. Well, anyways, he was here and so was Paige and Paigey was doing her homework while Kyle was doing, wasn't doing his. And then I said, you know, Kyle, you got to do your schoolwork. So get back over there and turn that computer on because they all, the schools, the school gave every child a computer. They rent them, I think, from the BOCES program, but still, every child has a computer. So he he did his math, 
And he's dilly-dallying, chalking away. And I said, just do the math. Don't need to talk to me. You know, just do the math. I'll sit here and listen to you. But I want to see you do your work. And so he did his work. And then he, instead of getting a pencil and paper out to, to do the the um, scratch work, my nose is itching. I have to mm -hmm. itch it. Yep, it was itching. It, maybe it'll be okay now. I don't know. <laughs> But anyways, instead of getting a pencil and paper out to do his scratch work, they, he went into his little thing where you use the mouse to draw the lines and make the numbers. But then he didn't like his nine, so he erased it and made another nine that looked exactly the same. <laughs> and I said, "That's you know that's a nine, just do it. I says, just do your mathematics. I says, It'd be, would you like a piece of paper and a pencil to maybe do it with? Nope, he didn't want that. This was more fun. So, okay, so he did that. And then he had to read a story. And his story was about Ellis Island. And he was talking about it. And he said to you, he goes, what year were you born? <laughs> and I go, I was born 1952. And he goes, well, Ellis Island was closed in 1954. And I said, but I didn't come over on the boat. Only Papa did. <laughs> and Ma Mama's, well, my grandparents did. My mom was born here. But I said, only Papa did. And he tried, we, that's probably why when we were trying to get, I remember him trying to get um, one of his aunts to come to America and they would not allow her to enter the, to America, the one borders. Of aunts. One of aunts. Oh, one of my dad's aunts. Yeah, my, yeah. my mom's family I think was, I don't know, I think they were all here already. So it was my dad that he was trying to get one of his aunts from Sicily over here and they had closed the borders and so we couldn't get her over but they were really trying there was a lot of correspondence going back and forth back and forth back and forth and the letters were in Italian so I don't know what they said but I remember that happening and that's probably why she wasn't able to come um, there was something else I was thinking of that I wanted to tell you that I now I forgot altogether mm, let me think I'm gonna Cut this part out so you won't have to think long. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> you didn't have to wait long, did you? Because <laughs> I'm going to chop it out and you won't know how long I actually sat there. But um, after he did his math and did his reading, and then we had to do our wiggle time. <laughs> so... <laughs> Yeah, it's it's he's wiggly anyways, but this is where they put a video on and you have to start running and then it will say jump and you jump and you duck and you weave and you and you run and you duck and you jump and you weave either left or right it tells you or you notice the picture some of them tell you which way to weave and some of them you have to just kind of pay attention. So I did this j running jumping ducking and weaving and I says man I says I wish it was just running the ducking and the and the jumping that I you know you forget how to jump but just try it get yourself up if you like after the video or now you can do it now if you like to where you put your just jump and see if you can jump <laughs> because it's hard when I was cheerleading I actually had to buy a trampoline or no, did we have? No, I already had the trampoline. I had to get on the trampoline just the to learn. The stepping trampoline. Yeah, the stepping one. Not a big one. I don't have one of those big ones. I have a little little exercise champ trampoline. I actually had to get on there because we had to do a, a tuck, a, I don't know, or something. We had to do some kind of jump. I don't know what they were called. Where's the legs are straight? No, it wasn't a tuck because a tuck you'd bring your knees up and you didn't have to do that. You had to keep your feet straight. And I had forgotten how to jump, so I practiced on that. I guess I've gone all over the place from I don't know where to I don't know where. And so now I'm going to go and say that's the end of this video. So I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>